Yeah. 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 Fifteen years. Huh? Under this bridge. Yeah. 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 You know that here? Yeah. <laughs> Who said make you come stay here? Your institution. Criminality in Nigeria's capital city, Abuja, over time, is no longer the preserve of the suburbs, as it appears from this raid. These illegalities have sneaked into the city center and appear to be thriving. The Joint Task Force of the Federal Capital Territory Administration, FCTA, says they will not condone this as they launched an operation which saw them raiding subways and bridges around the three armed zones, especially roads connecting Women Affairs Ministry, Police Headquarters, Court of Appeal and Federal Secretariat. Come from where? From Niger State. Good. And you are selling firewood in Abuja? Yes, sir. What is your firewood? Which is the location? Now here people they sell for Abuja here. Now here they sell for your wood. And they have those ones that are sell. You don't even know what it is. The people that sell food is who I have to buy them for your wood. Coordinator of the task force, Muktar Galadima, who led the operation, says it is in pursuance of the FCT minister's directive following this pleasing complaint from residents. But what we have seen today is really unfortunate that these things are happening in the city. Um, where informal activities are taking place under the bridges and people of questionable character were also staying or living or residing under the bridges. So we have to step up our action on combing and monitoring these uh, facilities and activities taking place under these facilities. Dr. Peter Olumuji, the secretary of FCTA's command and control center, corroborated Galadima's stance. Especially where you have bridges, they, they've complained about uh, these criminal elements coming out from the bushes in the night, snatching their phones, robbing them of valuables, even in their car, when they did not wind up properly. And immediately they do that, they go in under these bridges to hibernate. Naturally, you don't expect such a victim to pursue them because they don't know what they, they would see there. Joy Igoche, ITV News.